Hello everyone, how to simplify this nice algebraic expression? So if we have 5035 whole square plus 4965 whole square, so we write this algebraic expression into the simplified form. But you remember one thing is that calculator is not allowed in this problem. We will show all of the working on this paper. So here uh, the very first step we are going to do is first we rewrite this algebraic expression as in this form. We write this 5035 as 5000 and plus 35 whole square plus we write this term as uh, 5000 and minus 35. So it means that when you subtract 5035, you get here 4965 and it's all square. So in the next step, we need to uh, simplify these expression. Uh, so here, uh, if we suppose this is our A and this is our B. So I can just write it here. If we will take A equals to 5000 and B equals to 35 then it means that uh, this expression implies that uh, when you put 5000 equals a it will becomes a 35 equals b so we write a plus b whole square again we put here a and this is our b and we get a minus b whole square so here our claim is to find the value of a plus b whole square and a minus b whole square so uh, in order to find this value here uh, this is the our direct formula so if you remember the direct formula of uh, this then you can just use directly but if you uh, if you make some mistake uh, by writing this direct formula so i suggest that you will just uh, draw this formula easily with uh, once or two steps okay so in order to uh, uh, make the mistake uh, i think so i will uh, highly recommend that you can first draw this formula and then you can take these values in that formula okay so in order to find the value of this formula first we can uh, we know about the formula of a plus b whole square so it is equals to a square plus b square and plus two times of a b similarly we write the formula of a minus b whole square it is equals to a square plus b square minus two times of a b so here when we add these two formulas it means that when you add left hand side with the left hand side and right hand side with the right hand side then you get um, here in the left hand side we have a plus b whole square and a minus b whole square equals to this is a square plus a square becomes 2a square b square plus b square becomes 2b square this is positive 2ab this is negative 2ab cancelled out by each other and we will obtain here the nice formula of this is 2 times of a square plus b square so now here we uh, move backward and we substitute the value of a equals 5000 b equals to 35 in this formula so after applying after putting the values of a and b we will obtain here 5000 plus because the value of a is 5000 and value b is 35 whole square and the value of a is 5000 value of b is 35 whole square equals to two times of this is a square so the value of a is 5000 square the value of b is 35 square so uh, here first we write the left hand side as this will be written as 5035 square and this is 4965 square so this is the over given algebraic expression uh, which uh, here we get the in we which we get into the lowest form okay uh, so in the right hand side we have um, this is 2 times of 5000 square plus 35 square so in order to uh, move forward we first find the square of this value and the square of this value okay so here we write uh, the square of 5000 so uh, in order to find the scale of 5000 without using the calculator uh, we need to just first find the scale of 5 we know that the scale of 5 is 25 
and in order to find the square of these three zeros we can just write the doubled of these three zeros it will becomes the six zeros so this is the a very simple way to find the square of five thousand similarly here we uh, now find the square of 35 square because calculator is not allowed so we do all of the working here so we first uh, write this 35 square as 35 multiplied by 35 and we again break this value as 35 and here we write this 35 as 30 plus 5 so now we multiply this 35 on these two values and it will be written as 35 multiplied by 30 plus 35 multiplied by 5 okay so here we consider this is our one uh, this is our one number and this is our two digits number so here when you multiply this zero with this complete number we will get zero and when you multiply this three with this number you get three fives are 15 we write five and carry one three threes are nine nine plus one is ten okay we get 1050 here when you multiply this 5 with these numbers you get 5 5s are 25 we get write 5 and carry 2 5 3s are 15 15 plus 2 becomes here 17 so you get 175 so we need to sum up these two values and we add this 0 with this 5 so you get 0 plus 5 becomes 5 7 plus 5 plus 7 becomes 12 we write 2 and carry one so here you have zero plus one becomes one and one plus one becomes two so this is our one it means that uh, 35 square equals to 1225 and 5000 square equals to 25 and 60 so here we put uh, the square of these two zeros in equation number one uh, so in the next step our equation number one is written as so that our equation number one is implies that this is 5035 square plus 4965 square equals to uh, here we have two times of 5000 square and 5000 square equals to two five and six zeros and plus uh, 35 square equals to 1 double 2 and 5 so now in the next step we need to uh, sum up first these two values and add the last we multiply it by 2 so here we add this 0 plus 5 we will get 5 this 0 plus 2 becomes 2 this 0 plus 2 becomes 2 this 0 plus 1 becomes here 1 and we we write the other numbers as it is this is 0 0 5 and 2 so here we need to multiply this 2 with this number and we get here when you multiply 2 5 is a 10 we write 0 and carry 1 2 2 is a 4 4 plus 1 is 5 this 2 times of 2 becomes 4 2 times of 1 becomes 2 2 times of 0 becomes 0 2 times of this 0 becomes 0 2 times of 5 becomes 10 we write 0 and carry 1 2 2 is a 4 4 plus 1 becomes 5 so this is the our final answer of this question and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos